Imagine you have interviewed for a big tech company. They have asked you all the latest question on Java 25, Spring Boot 4, and you got selected. Now you are very excited because you are going to work on a latest project. But once you got onboarded, you found out that your application is running on Java 1.8 and Spring Boot 1.x. And you are like, what the heck is this? So have you ever wondered? Why the big tech giants always lag behind with respect to their tech stack? Let's find out in this video. Well, let's just do a little bit of time travel and let's just go back to 2014. Imagine you are the lead developer who is developing a product or an application for an insurance company. You have the role to choose the right tech stack and you are like, well, let's just go with the latest and greatest Java 8. Very powerful. Lambda, Stream, whatnot. But now you are like, well, how do I build a web application then? Well, the most popular thing I can go for is a Java EE. But then you thought, well, why not Spring Boot 1.x? Because this uses the Java EE behind the scene and I as a developer can enjoy writing the high level code by using controllers and all that. So now you log the Java 1.8, Spring Boot 1.x and build your application using all the related libraries and hand it over to your client and your client was really happy, they kept on using your application and whenever they have any issues or defects, they reported it back to you and you made a fix, commit the code, created a new release and given it back as a new version of that application. Now time passes by, Java evolved, Spring Boot evolved, but you as a tech lead didn't give a damn about it because our clients are happy, your company is making money. So why to fix something if that is not broken? But what if I want to upgrade my project? So let's switch to the latest spring version right now. But hold on, this is going to break my application because my JDK will not be compatible and I need to switch to the latest JDK version as well. But hold on, with this, some of the libraries might not work. For an example, for REST API, I have used Jackson. So I need to switch to the more recent version. But hold on, after this, I can see a lot of problem because some of the classes has been deprecated and some of the annotations are not even exist in the newer version of the Jackson API. And what the heck is this? Even for Spring Boot, wherever I made a REST call using REST template, now Spring Boot latest version is forcing me to rewrite those things with REST client. Well, there are so many compilation errors because right now the latest Spring Boot is not using the Java EE behind the scene, it's using Jakarta. So wherever I have used Java X related imports, I have to replace them with Jakarta. Well, to do this project migration, I may need to form a new team and that will cost me money. But why to fix something if that's not broken? What version of Java you are using in your company? Let me know in the comments.